Hello, 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 my dear student. In this lesson, we will be covering lesson seven, five, proportions and similar triangles. What is a proportion? Is an equation stating that two ratios are equal. How do we solve it? Using cross product. What are similar polygons? Two conditions must be met for similar polygons congruent corresponding angles, proportional corresponding sides. A very important concept is the scale factor, which is the ratio of corresponding sides. We already took that, and I'm just reminding you of what we have taken before. Now, when I talk about similar triangles, and we write the similarity statement and the proportion, triangles are similar if you show any two pairs of corresponding sides are proportional and the included angles are congruent. This is called SAS similarity. So this is the first similarity statement, SAS similarity. The second one is that all three pairs of corresponding sides are proportional, SSS similarity, side, 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 are proportional. The third one, is AA similarity. Any two pairs of corresponding angles are congruent. That would be enough to say that the two triangles are similar. Now, parts of similar triangle. We'll be talking about perimeter and area. Perimeter is the sum of all sides, or as I always tell you, it's the distance around the figure. So the perimeter of triangle ABC over the parameter of the other triangle, which is x, y, z, will be the ratio of corresponding sides as that. But if I'm talking about angles, we'll discuss the two angles lately. Here, if two triangles are similar, then the measure of corresponding medians are proportional to the corresponding sides. Also, an angle bisector in a triangle cut the opposite sides into segments that are proportional to the other side. Now, triangle proportionality theorem. If a line is parallel to one side of a triangle and intersects the other two sides, then it divides the other two sides proportionally. And we have the converse of it. Parallel lines and proportional parts. Triangle mid-segment theorem. We will discuss that in details. Also, if three parallel lines are intersected by two lines, then the lines are divided proportionally. So there is a proportion. We elaborate more. If three sides are parallel and intersect to transversal, then they cut into proportional sides. The ray bisect one angle of a triangle, then it divides the sides proportionally with the sides they are touching. Let's look at some worked example. This you will be solve it. I'll give you time to solve it alone, and then we'll discuss it in details like you see. I hope you will understand this lesson as you have understood all the previous lesson. Wish you all the best and have a good day. Bye-bye.